Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to Total War Wednesday. As always, I am D, and we're back here with the D with the Beastmen. Now, last time we managed to summon up the Bray Herd, which is back there. Two cyborgs, which is why I'm really happy about that. We also destroyed Karak Drawn. Kazrak into level. He also gained Siege Expert, which is always good. And that's just a decisive victory. Now, Goros. Yeah, Goros is just our usual super soldier here. <coughs> and and the turn, because else we really need to do. But yeah, right now the basic idea is we're going to slaughter our way through the dwarves. Oh, okay, so... Oh, okay. So I gained 750 favor because I did this. Okay, now I can get Scourge, which means I need to raid Middenheim, which is all the way up there. Raid Iron Rock. Huh. The Red Horns. Non-aggression with the Red Horns. Ungral Stoneheart of the Red Horn tribe. Non-aggression with the Red Horns works for me. Eventually my plan will be to incorporate them as part of my army. news, my lord. Uh -oh. the word is spreading across the land of a dark power rising in the northern wastes. The armies of chaos are on the move. We have been doing that for a while. To invade the world of mortals once again. Prepare your defenses well. I have no defenses. The of chaos spare no one in their quest for bloodshed. I have no defenses. Luckily. It's not quite Archeon just yet. Luckily all I do. Actually, you know what? I really shouldn't take Iron Rock just yet. Oh, well, my brain is gonna get that. Is gonna get screwed here. Maybe. The brain herd. Oh, the brain. My brain herd is being attacked by the. By the red horns. Why? Get beastly inclination. Well, unfortunately, that's the weakness of taking the. So far, has managed to work out peace with Averland and Sterling, so... Alright then, Kaza Dragon Slayer. The Beasts. Oh crap, I just noticed I probably should have gone with 1-1 one, one Fall. Okay, 
so I don't have any forces to control just yet. Which army is that? Alright, so that's actually Goros' army. This is not tactically sound, but I'm going to do it anyway. A attack, you idiots! Or at least let the Cygors start throwing. Why are they marching up? The Cygor is an artillery base. Oh, they're going for the leadership. Oh, luckily the Razor Gore Chariot should help out. Okay, so the site is not terrible in melee, that's good to know actually. Okay, good, the core bullet. Is... Oh. Eh, victory. You know what, that'll work. Also, I went for my next real Thursday. The heisting series was, it was only two episodes, but it was, what you're going to see tomorrow is something that I, as a game I have on a long time since I found out about it. I have to tune in to find out what it is, but it's ready. I've played some of it off camera to get, to get ready for it. I think you guys should, I think you guys might like will probably like it. Reject the gift of chaos so that I can get some more growth. Cosrock leveled up. The Children of Chaos. So that his horde will grow faster. The Unrelenting Warhead level 2. <coughs> Do the dwarves have anything south? Well, they've got Barak Var over there. Actually, you know what? The orcs are taking that, so...
Oh, I'm not actually at war with Zulfbar yet. So what? Our next target will be Akendorf. I'm gonna fight my way up to Middenheim. Consider their offer carefully. Yeah, why not? Hmm. <laughs> what? Who could lower recruitment costs? Slow down, four off. All right, so I get one hundred and twenty-one percent research speed. Let's get encircled prey. Siege. Hello, Gausser. We'll see. I don't actually have any useful assassins in my army right now. Actually, the only one I could really send is the Blood Claw, but he's kind of busy being, well, a f my frontline tank. All right, I forgot the red, the red horns and I are at peace now. Wait, I'm gonna wait three turns. That'll give me the speed bonus. 
That will also mean they've lost some of their troops to attrition. I know this is not the most entertaining thing to watch, but... Ooh. Unfortunately, that does not seem to affect the Bray Herds. to Achendorf again. Let's go ahead and start getting men cleavers. Now we attack. Half the might of theirs. Troops on these. Okay, those guys are correct. Is there another gate these guys could attack? Nope. I always forget how fast Kazrak actually is.
<laughs> We're actually crushing the defenders easily. troops 22 their whole army okay we actually wiped out quite a few so fun of that. I think they'd stop rebuilding Ockendorf after a while, but... Ooh, decent amount of loot. The Sword of Battle. Mm. You know, we're actually going to raise and defile this one. upon man. And we're going to go ahead and finish off the Unrelenting Warherd. So that next time he can actually get the Unrelenting Warherd too. the easiest way up to midnight is going to be just basically march through the heartland of the empire. Yeah, it's raid, it's raid midnight. failure the, of Enlog Gundrickson and failure by Kurt Albrecht. Minus three beast raid, but plus three for all recruits. I'm going to leave the creature be because I'm not recruiting anybody right now. I don't have the money.
Well, we'll have to deal with that later, though. Because that is the end of this episode, folks. Once it rolls over to my turn, we'll go ahead and save it and call it there. But if you enjoyed the show, please feel free to like or favorite the video. You can also leave a comment down below if you have anything you'd like to say. And remember that if you'd like to keep up with me, never miss any of my current series, then please feel free to click the subscribe button down below, or there's a link at the end of the video. As for that, folks, I have been D. The Beastmen are marching, but not one by one. So good night, and good gaming.